market together with a major MSO in the country. They had a specific need because they want to make a proof of concept of a new architecture using fiber to the core approach in Omaha, Nebraska. So our engineering team worked with them, analyzing all the specs, the situation, and we created a new type of RFOG mini node, which basically gives you several outputs, multiple ports outside the house, so that way you can use the current drop that the customers already have, but bringing the fiber closer to the home without changing anything. That way you can provide a better service without affecting the customer as much as if you're replacing everything inside the house too. As you can see in this pedestal, our multiple port mini node is replacing a traditional HFC tab. So basically you have in this case four ports, each one going to fit a separate house using the regular drop that the house already has. You have the fiber coming in from the plant. In this case, the powering is being made from the plant. So we have a special power adapter in the back that will take the regular 90 volts AC and will convert it to 15 volts DC, 500 milliamps to fit the unit as it requires. This unit also comes with a possibility to do a pawn overlay. So you will have a secondary port right here that will let you fit from here a pawn unit inside any of the houses. So that way you can combine RFOG with pawn in the same fiber and provide better services as needed by the customers. Traditional mini nodes are focused in a fiber to the home approach. So they basically have only one output for the RF part and they go inside the location with a specific level for that matter. But then you always need to put additional materials for the drop in order to split signal or, or to approach different areas. In this case, we put everything inside the box. So we have a four port mini node and an eight port mini node complying with everything that the CTE expects for RFOC. And then without any additional material, you can fit each house directly from the unit in a pedestal outside. So basically, you keep to use the same drop that they currently have installed and also provide a better service. I would say the, the main advantage of this is that in a traditional fiber to the home approach with RFOG, you need to put a fiber mini node in each house. In this case, you're only using one unit per every four houses or eight houses, depending on the case. Other big advantage is that you don't need to replace your current coaxial drop with fiber inside the house. So you're saving also costs in materials that maybe you installed a couple of years ago and are still in good conditions, you don't need to change that. So, so you're saving a lot of money in the deployment of the installation. For more information regarding this project and all the products we're bringing for RFOC, you can go to our website where you're gonna find the specs, application cases, and all the information you need.